I think it is a must watch, especially I was we were talking earlier, especially for us in the, the yeah, business. It's about a meteorologist. <laughs> he says in the high pressure is going <sighs> to <laughs> he like blows the I don't know. So you I got to a watch little, the movie. Yeah, a little more insight here on uh, Punk's mm -hmm. Phil. You see how biased he is. He's always mm -hmm. seeing his shadow. It's like 85 percent of the time that he's looking at his shadow. I think it's because of all the camera lights. You know? They cast shadows. There you go. That could be it. Yeah, even if it's, you know, sunny or whatever, cloudy, there's always lights out there. Mm -hmm. But this year he went no shadow, uh, meaning an early spring. According to stormfacts.com, 39% accuracy rate. Spring starts no matter what, March, March 19th. 19th. Yeah, that is a fact. It's not going to be wrong. <laughs> That's not going to change. Also, Petronilla um, Pete. Uh -huh. this, is, this is from the Bill Vesey archives. Here's our little text versation mm. there. Uh, I was asking him, hey, what did Pete say mm -hmm. in Petronilla? Uh, and he saw his shadow. It was sunny yesterday morning. So Pete is saying six more weeks of winter here. Ooh, okay. We'll see what that means. Obviously, this is just folklore. It's, you know, we're not saying anything that the groundhogs and brodents are saying is going to come true. But uh, we do have a strong cold front in the forecast. 61 degrees right now, a south wind at 10 miles per hour. Plenty of clouds out and about. We're going to see more clouds than what we've had over the weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Upper 50s, low 60s across the area and a south breeze at 10 to 15 miles per hour. That wind is going to become breezier today. It'll gust between 20 and 30 miles per hour as the South Texas wind machine is engaged, a low pressure feature at the surface in the panhandle contrasting with high pressure in the Gulf and that's funneling all of this south wind right into South Texas and you look off into Mexico a few showers those will track from west to east over South Texas here today then our cold front system this is working through the Rocky Mountain West this morning that'll be the feature that kicks a cold front through South Texas so windy today breezy and warm tomorrow and then our cold front comes through here. It looks like Wednesday morning at some point. It's going to bring in much colder air. We're going to go from the 80s to the 50s between Tuesday and Wednesday. And check out what happens possibly in central and north Texas. I don't think we see any wintry precept this far south, but between San Antonio, Austin and Dallas and points to the north of that, maybe some uh, snow or mixed wintry precipitation for those uh, in that part of the state. So this cold front's going to be strong. We're going to go from 85 down to 55 between Tuesday and Wednesday, about a 30 degree drop there uh, between the two days, a very noticeable change of pace headed our way. Today going to be spring like we'll have a few isolated showers pass through west to east, otherwise mostly cloudy and breezy with highs in the mid 70s. Tomorrow going to be even warmer, a little more sunshine, mid to upper 80s. Some locations may flirt with 90 degrees here on the high temperatures tomorrow. Humid as well. Monday, Tuesday, this front then comes in and takes all that humidity away here on Wednesday. Today, 75. Uh, we'll have more cloud coverage, a few isolated passing showers, and it will certainly be breezy. 15 to 25 mile per hour southeast wind tonight. With that wind staying up, it tends to keep temperatures up. We've got a lot of humidity too, so we'll stay in the mid 60s overnight. Warm Tuesday, three degrees shy of a record high. I've got us at 85 degrees and then Wednesday the bottom falls off there. 55 the forecast high. A few morning showers with that front. A cool crisp Thursday, which will start in the 30s here. It looks like Thursday morning and then beautiful. A sunny delight Friday and a mix of sun and clouds mild in the mid 70s for the weekend ahead. Leslie.